Hi, this is Jessica Andrews reminding you to always start your day with a balanced morning show like you have here. A skinny guy, a fat guy, and a real fat guy. I want to be the first chubby comic to live past 35. Pound for pound, the bull rocks. This is Craig Cornett in the morning. The bull, yeah. Most incredible story of the day. And let's let's remind everybody, T-Bone has started his journey yesterday on a weight loss program. Started with a personal trainer. Have you lost any weight yet? Uh, how I much don't will know. Uh, <laughs> No, technically, I'm I not would, a loser. I would I fire. I would fire that personal trainer. Uh-huh. If you, how much did you weigh when you went there yesterday? Uh, Three thirty on the nose. How do you weigh right now? I he weighed know. you I... on your nose. Oh, that's weird. God, that had to hurt. What a weird All trainer. Right. Wait, please, yeah. please, please, yeah, please, yeah, please put your nose. Awkward. Please put your nose on the scale. <laughs> loser. <laughs> you're going to be a big loser. Yeah, I have a feeling you're going to be a uh, big loser. I am. Okay, you weigh how much? Three thirty. You 330. said three thirty. Okay. Imagine that you were in a car, and you were in an accident, not wearing your seatbelt, and you were in a car with a sunroof. Do you think there's any chance of you being ejected through the sunroof? Uh, very slim. I know. No, you're slim, not. Well, slim is probably slim a poor pasta. choice of words. Poor uh, <laughs> <laughs> choice of words. Uh, you're a loser. We were. He is a loser, and that's he, a good he, thing. I know. I we know. were trying to come up with a theme song for his weight loss uh, uh, yesterday, and and I came up with a with a song. Uh, I've heard it in a couple of nightclubs um, when I was in Illinois. Well, he said he had a goes, problem with 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 how he ate. How it he was, ate. It was, was a portion. Like, I said it was all about portion control, and yeah. then I was going to sing. <laughs> oh, oh, portion control. Portion control. <laughs> ah. So we're going to get that song together yeah, for him. Yeah, definitely have to get portion that together. control. <laughs> yeah. Well, this woman also is is. Um, a little bit overweight. She's uh, a little more overweight than you. She weighs a little over 600 pounds. Wow. <laughs> Just a tad over. She <laughs> lives yeah. in uh, Florida, near Tampa. Oh, she was in a... In a in Whoa, a, mama! <laughs> <laughs> she was in an Isuzu Amigo. How how big is that? An Isuzu Not Amigo. It's a, an SUV, but it's a small one. That would be equivalent to a Ford Escape, maybe? Would be equivalent yeah. to yeah, a Suzuki size. Sidekick? Yeah. <laughs> Something yeah. Like that. Uh-huh. <laughs> She's in an Isuzu Amigo, drinking a Diet Dr. Pepper, Mm -hmm. when another car cut her off, (laughs) and she had to swerve to get out of the way. She flipped the car. Okay, she weighs 600 pounds. When the car flipped, she was thrown through the sunroof. And her being thrown through the sunroof saved her life. She survived the accident because she was thrown clear of the car, wasn't wearing her seatbelt, but in this case, it was a good thing. At, uh, the accident investigators haven't said whether or not um, I'm not. You know what? That I, I'm going to leave that out because that's that's a, that's mean. Whoever wrote this story, but was that's mean. <laughs> I'm not saying that. Come on. Uh, no, paramedics airlifted her to uh, Tampa General Hospital. Oh God! I should have read further into this story. The helicopter couldn't take off with her in it. Oh, no. Oh, wow. Oh, my. Oh, my. I thought the sentence before was mean. Now, I'm not trying to be mean about this. I'm just reporting the story. She was thrown through the sunroof of an Isuzu Amigo, and the helicopter came to rush her to the hospital and couldn't take off because of the uh, that was just too much weight for the helicopter. So they had to get an ambulance to come to the scene to take her to the hospital where she is perfectly fine. Good for her. She's almost not injured at all. After being rolling the car, thrown through the sunroof, and landing on the ground, and not hurt at all. Fine. Stable condition. She's going to be perfectly okay. Jeez. Unbelievable story. Unbelievable. Well, uh, well, when they got there with the helicopter and it wouldn't pick her up, I mean, were they... uh, What? It did... I guess they landed the helicopter first, or they just kind of put a big old sling and they no, planned no, on stop carrying it, her. Stop it! I'm not gonna stop it. No. You know what, I'm not gonna let the, you turn a legitimate news story try, into not, making fun of fat no, people. No, I was because because we're not we're not gonna do this on. I'm on, fat. You're not fat. T Bone's fat. No, he's not that fat. I am fat, <laughs> but he's but a loser. You don't have back fat. He's a uh, loser. Well, I have plenty of back fat, <laughs> but he's a loser. <laughs> 
He's a, he's a loser. Soon to be. Boy, he's my a, morale is up. <laughs> he's a fat loser. He's a fat <laughs> he, he is. And that's a good thing. He's a fat loser. He's losing more fat every it's day. It's good to be you. It is good to be you. Yeah. You are a Yay fat loser. 